And in tonight's Don't Waste Your Money report, saving money on your energy bill and new protections for prepaid account users. Joanne Purton joining us now with this important information. Joe, good afternoon. Yeah, to you too, Glenda. We're going to start with those prepaid accounts. They are wildly popular and becoming even more so, you know, those prepaid visas and other things. One common form is a general purpose reloadable card, right? They're available at any number of stores or online. You can load money onto these cards and use them for everyday purchases. It is expected by the year 2018, consumers will load these cards with $112 billion. Well, now the Consumer Financial Protection Bureau has finalized a new rule providing strong protections for users of these cards. Some of these rules include financial institutions must limit consumer losses when funds are stolen or cards are lost. They must investigate and resolve errors that occur, and they must give consumers free and easy access to their account information. The rules also require customers be given clear information up front about any fees that they could be charged with those cards. Also, today is the first National Energy Efficiency Day in the market. The Consumer Federation of America is offering 12 ways to save energy and money. Among them, check your furnace, heat pump, and AC filters once a month and replace them regularly. How long has it been since you've done that? Also, get your heating system checked once a year. A licensed professional can make sure that it's operating efficiently and safely. Install a programmable thermostat and lower the thermostat on your water heater to 120 degrees. Water heaters are the second highest source of energy use in your home. Also, if you can't caulk and weather strip around drafty doors and windows. You can find all 12 energy saving records recommendations right now at WXYZ.com. I'm Joanne Purton, 7 Action News. All right.